Ponfos is a town on the cusp of radical transformation. Located 50 kilometres northwest of Oslo, it is set to be integrated with the Oslo region as soon as a new railway arrives. With journey times to Oslo cut down to 30 minutes, Honfoss is going to serve as a suburb to the fast-growing capital. To expand on the town's rapidly changing identity, the task is to develop a new pilot neighbourhood in Jotelja, an area of farmland and forest close to the town centre. Located between city and countryside, between man and nature, Jotelja is meant to become an ecotone, meaning a region of transition between two biological communities. We strongly believe that agriculture has to stay local, but the size of the site does not suit modern wheat culture anymore. However, it matches the average dimensions of classic fruit or vegetable fields. The usual spacing between trees in an orchard is 8 metres, which is also the case for the average market garden row spacing. We have based the overall layout on this dimension in order to create an 8 metre squared grid oriented according to the slope of the site to maximise solar gain. The very first action will then be to connect Jotelia to Honfoss through a new bike lane across the river. This lane will lead to a new central plaza next to the old school. This building will then be refurbished into a new agricultural school, a market hall with local products and a community restaurant. Once Jotelia has become this organic agricultural hub, we will prototype solutions in a local try and test attitude to bring amenities and attraction to the area. We will take advantage of the long delay before the arrival of the new train to provide young professionals with vocational training in rammed earth, thatch and timber construction. Thanks to a dedicated workshop, we can foster interest in the building industry using these sustainable building techniques. Within the training, apprentices will build one-to-one -one earth structures on the land strips left over by crops. These rammed earth towers will provide a structure on which future housings will be grafted. Thanks to the social and productive superstructure built during phases one and two, the site will finally host a housing development. The housing blocks will be built in a metabolic process around the rammed earth towers. This flexible aggregation process allows a wide range of form and typologies from small individual apartments to duplexes of even stacked houses. If this condition of cooperation is met, Jotelia is to be a model of productive ecotone where agriculture, manufacturing and housing interact with each other and grow in a metabolic way. Thus, our project should be understood as an example of attitude rather than a rigid design.